Hello and welcome! I am Scatterbrain and this is Minecraft Story Mode. And we are going to start episode 6 today. But first, I have a slight little mini rant about DLC. And if you want to skip my little mini rant about DLC, uh, I'll put an annotation on the screen so you don't have to listen to me angry and upset about this. But, it, you know, you can skip it if you want. But, I had to pay $15 for this episode 6, 7, and 8. Are you kidding me? The, the story was already going on. I, I got the first part of the story for free. Well, I mean, I paid $24.99 for the freaking game, but I got the first part of the, the story for free. And basically, they're making me pay, they made me pay for a continuation of the story. I didn't get anything extra. I didn't get like a cool wallpaper, screensaver, anything. I literally just got more game. All right. And I don't know, maybe that doesn't sound like a valid argument, but I paid $24.99 for this game. So basically, up until now, I have now paid $50 for this game when I was of the understanding that the $24.99 I paid was all I needed to pay to, get to, to play the entire story. So I'm a little angry about this. And, you know, it's just like... DLC, basically, I hate DLC. I, I've hated it since it, they first started doing it. I absolutely 100% refuse to pay for DLC. I almost never buy it. I, I mean, this is probably the second or third DLC, air quotes, DLC, that I've actually bought. Because I think it's dumb, especially for a $60 video game. Like, if this was a $60 video game... I wouldn't have fit, I wouldn't have bought this DLC. There's not a chance. The fact that it was only $25 was pretty much the reason I, I was like, okay, fine, I'll pay for it. But I I was just so angry that I had to pay for extra or not even extra, more story. I didn't get anything extra. That's what I'm angry about. And you can't tell me this game has a 9 out of 10 on Steam. All right? It has been released on every major platform, iPad, Android, Xbox, PlayStation, obviously PC, Wii. It has been released on every platform. You're telling me Telltale Games really needed an extra $15? No. That's a, that's a grimy money grab right then and there, and I am very angry about it. But we're going to continue on. So, welcome back, guys, to... Uh, if you skipped my little mini rant, uh, welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode Episode 6. Let's get into it. Let me drink some of my coffee during this loading screen. Mmm, tasty coffee. On Minecraft Story Mode. Ooh, previously. We get a previous. That glow, that enchantment is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. What? Something existed before the Order of the Stone? Oh my gosh, that's amazing! I don't know what's so amazing about it. Uh-huh. Yeah, those are all the portals. I guess we're gonna have to go into some of them. Try and find a way home. Why didn't we just go back through the portal we came in and then go find the portal that we originally were at? That we came through. I feel like that was a smarter move than what we did. Or what we're going to do, I'd imagine. Look, a bat. Hi, bat. Fly away, bat. Actually, there's tons of bats. Oh, there's me. Okay, so we did go into a portal. Interesting. Listen, I don't know if that bat belongs there. Okay, guys, I'm seeing grass, forest, lots of ground in all directions. All good signs so far. Well, we're not in the nether. Good, good. Good assessment. Two moons. Uh -huh. Verdict says, definitely not our world. You owe me two iron, Lucas. Pay up. Okay, okay. Here. <laughs> Told you it was a dumb bet. Oh, who asked you? <laughs> Did you hear it? No one asked uh, you. Spooky forest? It's the sound of a new adventure. I bet this place is going to be awesome. I I'm actually, I'm, I'm just... pretty sure it's going to be awesome. Uh, I'm just worried about Axel and Olivia. Where are Axel and Olivia? Why? They're well, in our world. They're fine. The old builder temple and went through the portal. Oh, that's true. They would arrive in Sky City. 
to find it overflowing with monsters. Yeah. Okay, I didn't think of that. At least we already built them the bridge. That is more than we started with. Yeah, well, I hadn't I thought, had of thought of that. About that. If they followed us, they could be in trouble. Yeah, I know. Hey, uh, maybe next time we're in the portal hall, we can leave a sign or something. Is there going to be a next time? Going through. I like that idea. Well, I for one vote that we not be so hasty to try and get out of here. Who knows what sorts of treasures this new world could hold? That's what I'm saying, Ivor. Sucks. Unless the next portal. Also, I just found out the other day that that guy, uh, the guy, the voice of Ivor is the same person who was Pee Wee Herman. I just found that hilarious. Some sort of shape over there. Yeah, it's a floating book. There's some quartz. Let's find out. Let's do it. When did I get a crown? Why do I have a crown? I don't remember. It's been so long since episode five ended. Like it hasn't been that long actually, but for me in my two hour memory span, um, it's been really long. So I don't even remember really what happened. Invitation. Ooh, we get invited to something? Read immediately, your life depends on it. Eh, that's just a warning. Yep, okay, you know what? It may have right. not been a warning. Keep reading, Jesse. Got your back. Okay, yeah, I read. I humbly invite you to my mansion for an evening of food and festivity with your fellow adventurers. How do you know there's fellow adventurers? You're assuming a lot with this book. Weird, right? Whoa! Indeed, whoa. He is very close to you. You want to punch him? Yeah, there you go. Okay. Right trigger. Oh, jeez. They sometimes sometimes it's A, sometimes it's the right trigger. It's like you really have to pay attention in this game when when you actually get a chance to do something, which isn't very often. I'd like to point out. So. Find Jesse's place. Got it. Yeah. See, now it's X. Now it's B. So it's not very often you get a chance to actually interact in the game, which doesn't really make it a game at that point. It's just kind of like a movie going on in front of my face. Occasionally, I get to choose an answer, but you don't. I you like you don't recognize which button. At least I don't. I don't recognize which button I'm supposed to be hitting because I'm not used to like actually having to do something. Yeah, that is a lot of zombies. Probably not. This place hasn't exactly been friendly so far. Yeah, it could be a trap. It's too, Lucas. This has trap written all over it. It really does. Unfortunately, with all these zombies everywhere, we can't exactly stick around out here. It's very true. We need to go. I'm going to go out on a limb and say, that's the place we're looking for. Right I don't know how you could there. assume something like that, Ivor. There's no oh, way yeah. that is a I mansion on a hill that we could totally be looking for. Bad knees. You pick up that excuse at the same place you got that haircut? Because we need to stick together. Hey, just try not to die, okay? Yeah, that's I'm what to I said. Everyone together here. Sure, sure, that's fine. But you gotta catch me first. Fair enough. Let's not die, though. Seriously, uh, no one wants to become a zombie. It's not. It's actually not a lot of fun. Ooh, hey, the credits are rolling. I'm gonna drink some of my coffee during the credits. I, I made a huge pot of coffee, and that's probably why I'm so jumpy right now. But uh, I made a few. I made a huge pot of coffee, so I've just been trying to drink it at this point. Yeah, go Petra. Good job. Oh, I actually have to do things. Crap! I can't drink my coffee. That hurt. Mmm, coffee. All right. Whoa, Ivor, you really should pay attention to where you're going, dude. Stand up. <laughs> he just face planted. That was like an epic face plan. It really was. All right. Bam. A telltale story. Eric Stride. Oh, jeez. Do something. Well, that was a little violent. Oh, jeez. That was not what I was expecting. Oh, oh, I still have to dodge. <laughs> didn't realize that. Whoa. Oh, I can jump things, it seems. I just didn't have to because I got out of the way of it. Mark Hammer's still here. I don't know. I just remember certain names from the credits. Like, there, I believe Eric Parrott is one of them. Jeff Parrott. There we go. Jeff Parrott was responsible for environments. <laughs> Oh, still, still have to dodge. Oh, jeez. Okay. I, see, I pressed the wrong button there. Ow. I just got slapped by a zombie. That wasn't very nice. Oh, jeez. Spitter. Uh, dodge the spider. Good job. Good job. Good job. Oh, jeez. Another spider. What do, what do we do? You want to stab him? Yeah, stab him. There you go. That's you the ticket. That too, right? Almost sounds like a waterfall. Oh, jeez. Get on the rocks. Get on the rocks. Swim to the rocks. 
Oh, oh jeez, I actually have to swim. Oh boy. Ow, ow, that hurts. It's not nice. And going down. Am I dead? Oh jeez, there we go. No, I'm not dead. Sweet, okay. Jump over there, I guess. Good job. These are some strong vines. Nice. So does it ever become daytime here? I bet you the two moons have something to do with the amount of zombies. I, I'm, I'm almost positive that's why. It just seems like that that would be a reason for why there are so many zombies. That's just, that's just my thought, though. But we're going to just dodge the zombies here. Because that's what we need to do. Oh, skeletons. You didn't actually pull your bow back there. You just kind of pulled the arrow back. Okay. Uh, right. They're actually shooting more of the zombies than anything else. Well, oh, hey, Petra, Lucas, good job. That was, that was some crazy, crazy moves right there. Let me tell you. Oh, oh, whoa. Right. Right. Yeah, that was, that was normal. I, I do that on the weekends. That's, that's how I, that's how I slice fruit. Execute maneuver 66. What is maneuver 66? Stairs. Oh. Could have just said stairs. I can't say that name. Muckin' how? I don't know what that was. Why is this game? This game like it hates my computer. It just it always uh, hangs up at like random points for a second. I probably shouldn't be drawing attention to it, but it's you know I notice and it's bugging me. Coffee time. Woo! Nailed it. Yes, and okay, yes, indeed okay. you did. You won that one, Jesse. Let's maybe Sweet. get inside the mansion before we pat ourselves on the back too much, shall we? Ivor, the voice of reason all over. It's a good thing we brought that guy. Because we're just a bunch of kids dicking around. That front door is definitely a no-go. I'll agree with that. Oh, we've been noticed. Stick with me, guys. Right. I think it's when it starts saving. I, I think that's when it hangs up. Oh, gosh. Uh-huh. Oh, good. yeah, just jump, jump, jump on their heads. Straight Mario right there. That was good. That was good. Hey, there's a guy up there wearing a pumpkin. The heck? Yeah, that was what? definitely creepy. What did you see? You just gasped. Like you'd seen something. Run now. Talk Run later. Now. Talk later. Good plan. I agree. It is a very good plan. Too many zombies. Great. There's no door back here. Why did you just assume there was a back door? Uh, um, what? Oh, oh, window. Look at, look at. There. There, there's we so many zombies. Breaking through there. That's very true. We Freeze. could do that. We can cut those down. Good do you see how many zombies there are? Oh my gosh. Okay, it's a good thing we jump around the screen like crazy, and they still have to walk like normal people. You know, that's how you do walk. things in Minecraft. Hey, you never know when those will come in handy. Listen, my inventory is like always full of locks. Then break the window and get us into the blasted place. That's a good idea. Punch. Hope the host doesn't mind us breaking their window. I'm sure he'll find it in his heart to forgive us. Or he'll hunt you down like animals. One or the other. That's kind of my thought that's about to happen. We're, gonna, we're about to get hunted down like animals. Wow. Some kitchen. Oh, Indeed. God. You know I don't care if you took it. Torque dog. Oh, Captain Sparkles is here. That was the one redeeming quality about this. Was that they actually got real YouTubers to do some voice acting? Show up super late, make us all sit and wonder what the heck is going on. This is your house, right? No, it's not our house. If it is, we've all been waiting for like hours. It's rude. Now easy, Torque dog. We got one of these invitations too. We did. What the heck is going on here? They don't know. They were asking us. For the language. That wasn't about you getting an invitation. Just that I was hoping you could explain things. This is Torque Dog. Sup? And I'm Captain Sparkles. Though, maybe you know that already. Captain Sparkles? I've got, like, nine million fans? Captain Sparkles? Are you saying that with a Z? <laughs> <laughs> Show some respect. The man's a captain. <laughs> Sorry, Captain. 
Civilians, am I right? <laughs> it really is awesome to meet you. I'm Jesse, and that's Petra, Lucas, and Ivor. John. <laughs> what the hell yes. just happened? That's a girl's name. Hey, I resent that. What are you guys anyway? Some sort of <clears throat> loser patrol? My name's oh, Jesse oh, in real life, by the way, guys. If you guys didn't know, like, I really do resent that. It, we're a big deal. Yeah. We're just, we're cool guys, well, you know? Thought. Oh, I didn't actually answer. Oops. I tried to. Cool it. That sea of zombies has us all trapped. So we just need to try our best to get along. Yeah, listen Work. to Captain Sparkles hey, over here. Ever. Just try and look on the bright side. Can we work we together? Can we work together to get through those zombies, power in numbers and all that? That's what we're trying to figure out. Just can't get everyone to work together. Yeah, Torque Dog seems really angry. All them weird zombies are gone. <sighs> Torque Dog is out of here. Okay, so the sea of zombies isn't normal. It's good to hear. Two moons is normal though, right? Um, the moons. Uh, yeah. Why don't you know about this stuff? You from like out of town or something? Yes. <laughs> Did you hear that? What is? It? Why do my eyes have like lines? This is weird. What's up with the lights? What's going on? What's going on? Ask the obvious question. Is Captain Sparkles? No, nope, Torque Dog's dead. Hey, Jesse. Jesse, come here. I'm about to get made fun of again. You've got a, a girl's name. Screw yourself. I'm glad you died. You're the exact person in high, in middle school that I wanted to die. Screw yourself. Torque Dog. Things just got a little real for a second there. I'm guessing calling dibs on his inventory would be Ivor. Jesse isn't a girl's isn't name. Just a girl's name. Yeah, really. All those arrows, his inventory, everywhere. How did that? Who? One minute he's alive, the next gone. You've never died in Minecraft before? Were you guys close? Pretty broken up about this. Were you guys close? I mean, not really. He was kind of a tough guy to be close with, but it's still terrible. That's true. Oh, it's in the ceiling. Everyone stand back. Let me There's a see there must be a pressure out. plate. This is why is this happening? Gunpowder. I don't know. Don't Captain Sparkles, calm down. down. Pretty much what you'd expect, I guess. <gasps> oh. It's some type of trap to get the inventory items. Who would do this? There's the trap door that sucked up Torque Dog's stuff. Yes! Looks Thank like you. Match set with that arrow dispenser up there. Clearly. You saw his stuff. He didn't really have anything worth stealing. Perhaps it was simply to dispose of the evidence. Oh, that's true. That is very true. That, that could be a... It's getting creepier by the minute. I agree with you, and Captain Sparkle's constant Guys, worrying is not helping. Yeah, Ivor, you know potions and enchantments and weird stuff like that. What do you make of it? <laughs> and stuff like that. It's a poison arrow. Smells like yes, potion of poison. Obviously, oh, tipped arrow. Oh, I've heard of those. They're they're still pretty new. Oh, yeah, nasty. they are. You're Stop. right about that. Using potions to make arrows. The possibilities are fascinating. Would you stop pointing that thing all over the place? You're making me nervous. What else are you not telling us? These tipped arrows. Yeah, the Captain else, Sparkles. You know, come on. You're not implying what I think you're implying, are you? Because I had nothing to do with this. Nothing. Could have sworn I saw someone doing a tutorial on how to make those not too long ago. My nerves are too shot to remember who right now. You are a little Hello. antsy right now, let's be honest. Back to you. Hello? Everything okay in here? Whoa! What's with the crowd? I, uh... I was just about to get everyone together to tell them at once. I don't actually know who this girl is. I believe I've heard of her. I just can't think of her name right now. It's you. I recognize you. How do you recognize me? Excuse me? Uh, that's not possible. Yes. What? It's a long story, but that's actually impossible. There's no way we could have met before. I'll show you. Follow me. Am I about to see a let's play of Minecraft story mode? I feel like I'm about to get to see a let's play of Minecraft story mode. Lucy, hi. Did you see all these new Oh, you've got them with you. What? <gasps> oh. 
Well, first it was the portraits of the people already here, then poof. You guys. Okay, that is creepy. Unexpected. Yeah, no kidding. One of these people is Shadow Lady and the other is Stacy Plays. Again, I, I don't watch either of them, so I have no idea which one's which. perfect. Lucas's nose is a little messed up. Must have been when it looks like a clown up. nose. Flattering how well they captured our likenesses. Some of us. What are you talking about? Yours looks just like you. This is creepy. This is so ridiculously creepy. It really is. Right? At first I was like, oh cool, fan art. Flattering. But the more I thought about it, creepy is definitely right. <laughs> fan well, art. You just assumed it was fan art hanging on the wall. Oh, let's huddle up in the dining room. Oh good. Damn dime minecarts here. Can't wait to hear the big news. Me neither. Or that one, Stacy. I'd have no idea who some of these people are. Ooh, I hope there's cake. That's Stampy, obviously. No, Come on, let's do this. Come on, Winslow. Yeah, I don't know who the red-headed girl is or the pink-headed girl is. I have no idea who those ones are. I got the rest of them down, though. What's going on? Hey, let me introduce you all properly. All right. You guys That'd be great. Cassie Rose and LD Shadow. Lady. Okay, so the pink one is Shadow Lady. This is Stacy Plays, Stampy Cat, and that's Dan, the Diamond Minecart. W when did your hair change color? Wasn't it? It's funny. Before you guys showed up, we all knew each other here. <laughs> Their names are Jesse. He just dyed his hair like a few months ago, I think. And Ivor. You Sweet. That was news. Is it good? Good news? Uh, yeah. It's um bad news, I'm afraid. Tor you notice someone's missing? Is dead. Good heavens. Oh, no. Wait, what? But Torkdog was so tough. There was nothing that could take him down. What happened? Yeah, what on earth is going on here, Sparkles? We're looking easy, into it. Easy, easy, everyone. We're looking into it, and we're going to figure it out. And I'm just supposed to trust you? Stacy, hey. Yeah, jeez, come on. They Torque Dog died, too. They can help. Everybody calm the heck down. I can't believe Torque Dog's gone. Just like that. Just like that. So what happens to That's how it happens. Whoa, how can you say that? What? It's a valid question. It fell into the floor. Come on, everyone. Come on. Don't get greedy. Just, I want to know what happened. For curiosity's sake. Uh-huh. This stuff just disappeared. Went down this weird hole in the floor. It did. Are we just supposed to take your word for that? Guys, Listen, Stampy. Calm the heck down. He was poking around in Torque Dog stuff right before it got sucked into a hopper. So I'm Everyone's so skeptical of each other. You know we're all in this situation this together, right? about Torque Dog, or is there a bigger picture? Yeah, why have our portraits? I don't know, guys. No yeah, we're not popular it. YouTubers like or anything. Be about him. Am I picking up some beef here? Uh, what? No! I don't know what you're talking about. What, like you think he deserved it? Well, that sounds pretty harsh, but, uh, I don't know, maybe? Hey, he did say I have a girl's name, so... I don't know, maybe Someone he did deserve it. For a reason, including Talk Dog. What if we're all in danger? Oh my gosh! Dan's right! Whoever's doing this, they could be hunting us! That was my oh, thought. I thought we were gonna get hunted. We can work together. I, knew I never should have come here. I didn't say anything. Oh, this is bad. This is so very, very bad. Oh, all of this danger talk has my stomach all queasy. Alright, geez, Stampy, Stampy, calm down. Over here. I need to talk to you about something. Uh-huh. Lizzie. Psst. Lizzie. The more I think about it. The more I think that there's something these people really don't want us to know. Uh huh. He's got to know the truth about what's going on here. It'd be nice to figure out what on earth is going on here, especially De detective if we're going to be time. These people until dawn. Sounds like we've got a mystery to solve, people. Luckily, Detective Jesse is on the case. Okay, that just sounds that just sounds Let's a bit arrogant. Investigating then, Detective Jesse, because I know what I'm doing. All right, guys, I do believe I'm going to leave that here for today. We will go and talk to all these YouTubers who are very antsy right now and giving me anxiety in the next episode, and uh, we'll see what's going on. But thank you all very much for watching this episode. If you guys did enjoy, go down below and leave a like or a comment. Let me know what you thought of the video, or you can subscribe to the channel if you are new. There's also some videos on the screen. Go check out. But other than that, you know, we'll, we'll figure out what's going on next episode, though. So, 
slow. So, thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you all next time.